Howdy virtual farmers, it's Nick and we're back at Fernie Farm for another exciting chapter in our farming simulator journey. From mastering machinery to optimising our yields, today's episode is all about taking our farming empire to the next level. So buckle up, hit that subscribe button and let's dive into the action together. The farm beckons and the adventures continue right here at Fernie Farm. So last episode we managed to get our clucking coop um, and now we have a chicken loose. Hmm, I never said you could leave my shelter. Anyway, uh, so to be able to sustain this chicken coop, we do need wheat. Wheat is currently, um, I think it's harvestable during July and August. So we are actually at the perfect month to possibly even purchase someone else's wheat fields and potentially steal some wheat. Obviously it's not theft because if I purchased the field it's my wheat and it's not theirs. Um, but on top of that actually we could always check the contracts. Now I do remember we have some fertilizing contracts we need to fulfill as well. We have these two which we will do. I'm just wondering do any of these have any uh, wheat? Yes. So field 47 has some wheat. Now we could go ahead and do this contract too to just get some of their yield at the end of it because obviously um, you will be left over with a couple of hundred litres or so of wheat and although it may not be much it might do us some justice with our current chickens. So first of all I think what we're going to do is go and do these fertilising contracts just because we are quick easy money and we could probably get them done very fast. I don't remember accepting these last episode, so I may have actually made a little bit of a mistake, and I may have accepted them um, the episode before, and completely forgot to do them this ep uh, last episode. But uh, it's not the end of the world. So I'm just going to head over to number 43, which is our closest one, um, and maybe actually nip to the shop first because I don't think we quite have enough fertilizer to fulfill um, field number 43 because 43 is quite a large field you see so yes I'll go to the shop first Nyum. I'm sorry about the huge delay guys in terms of the episode I have been rather ill recently and it started off with the flu and gastroenteritis uh, and then I ended up losing my voice which isn't great so finally my voice has come back I'm still a bit uh, a little bit rusty because it has been a little bit of a while since I have recorded an episode so I do apologize to you all for that however I will be getting back into the swing of things I just won't be doing too many episodes because I do work full-time as well so I do need to keep that in mind you know because obviously recording and editing two episodes a week is quite a big task on its own okay so i'm just going to buy a couple of these uh probably fit two of them in yet but yeah recording all of these episodes is the easy part but then i tend to spend quite a bit of time on the editing side of things um now i am quite new to all of this so you have to bear with me um, but as we progress now as you can probably see the channel has grown it's 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 grown it just keeps growing um i've i've been off sick and i've just been sat here like wanting to record because I, I, like everyone's just watching my videos and it's fantastic to see guys you know it's it's great to see that this community is is growing really fast um now i, I you know i'm on a, around at the time of this recording around 150 subscribers which is phenomenal I, I did a post at 50 subscribers and I thought okay this is slow growth brilliant but no it's been blowing up guys especially grandpa's farm which I am uh, yeah it's amazing to see how many of you are coming and joining us on these farming adventures it's you know I'm I'm flabbergasted, put it that way. Um, but yeah, so we are going to fertilise 
um, both of these fields just to collect these contracts because obviously I've accepted them and I don't remember when it's been that long since I've recorded so I don't remember when I did accept them but it's been a while now okay so well there's a bit of a hill there a uh, hilly billy Nyum. let's collect that money and field 24 which is quite a small field it's only three acres we should be able to do that reasonably quick and with very little use of our fertilizer and our actual um, equipment as well Nyum. Right, yeah, I think we are coming up to field 24 now. It's just um, on the other side of this building here. Um, and I think we might actually... Whoa! I think we might actually be able to do this in... Um, I'm going to say two runs, okay. One up and one down. Alright, I am going to set AI to do this for us, though. Just so then I can scout out some other land and some other jobs in the meantime so let's have a quick look at different lands around and what land we can possibly even purchase so we just want these wheat these two over here a small field up there um i'm just thinking which one was that contract for now actually for field 47 just actually quite big i'm hoping i can get this farmland here oh no 800,000 smackaroos which i definitely cannot afford that um, and the ai has finished that field so i'll just collect that money and um, that was very fast actually but it's only a very small farm okay so field 47 Wow, I wasn't expecting the fields to be just this expensive, in all honesty. Maybe it's because they are due to be harvested. 114,000 for that one. I can't afford. So yeah, I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to stick to actually harvesting some of these lands. Instead of, you know, going and purchasing one just for the wheat. Because, well... We don't have much wheat, to be fair. Okay, so checking out my loan, we do have £320,000 left on the loan, um, which we could potentially take out. And we have £40,000 on us. Okay, now let's check to see what farms are near us, which are possibly even empty, because that could help us significantly so i think farm 41 is actually empty right now um so yeah that's recently been plowed um and farm 40 is what exactly that is oat now we don't want oat now, i am thinking this this 41 here 141 pounds so need around 90 000 pound extra well, I think that could be good for us. Okay. And it has nothing planted on it just yet. So I'm going to need uh, quite a bit of money. So I'm just going to... I'm going to get around 200... I'm just going to bring it up to 400k. Okay, that leaves 100k of loans left um, for whatever else we need in the future. Um, so yes, yeah, so I am going to purchase this bit of land here, uh, which leaves us £129,000. And then I know I'm going to, it sounds a bit silly, but we do need some more money to be generated. So I am going to grab another one of these solar panels. I'm going to max out and we are going to have four of them. Uh, three of them. Three of them. Oh, ignore me. Um, before I do that, I'm just going to drive back so I don't have to move so far across the map just to do this. I probably could spend... Ah! Whoa! Go on. Oh, there. <laughs> I don't know how that little car knocked me over like that. 
and you'd expect it to be the other way around in all honesty. Um, I swear these these cars are like Teslas with like a centre of mass so low that you can't tip it over. Um, quite possibly actually. So yeah, we are gonna head head back over to our farm. Nyum. So if you do like this series so far guys, be sure to hit that like button. Um, as it does help out a ton and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon okay now we are back at the farm I am gonna go ahead and purchase that secondary solar generator solar panels because we need to make some money quite f fast but what these three will do is they will give me a steady income over the months so it should be around twenty seven thousand pounds a month something something like that between i don't know between 15 and, and 30 maybe so yeah that should uh keep us going um and we have also purchased this field here which is quite a large field um and i believe is it is it time for the planting yet no, so planting season is in September and October, so we will wait until September and then we can actually get our farm started in terms of our wheat production for our chickens. And hopefully if we have enough wheat production, I may even purchase a secondary chicken coop at some point. But until then guys, let's sleep. <laughs> right, so we made around £12,000. Um, over the last month, I've just realised, in fact I realised halfway through sleeping, that we were going to go and do a contract for some wheat. Now hopefully that is still here, and we can still do that. Yes, so we can still do this. Okay, so we are just going to accept it and use our own equipment, because I... Do I have a harvester? I do have a harvester. Where's my header for my harvester? That's... That's slightly concerning. Did I sell the header? Why would I do such a thing? Oh. I sold my header. Yes, yeah, so we do need to get another header. Um, I'm just thinking we don't actually need this tractor right this moment. We need you. And we also need to accept this contract okay so that is for wheat um, let's just check to make sure that our um, trailer is empty otherwise we are gonna struggle moving all this wheat it does look empty so that's a plus there we go yeah that is empty Okay, so first things first, we do need to get a header for our harvester. So we'll just hover over the harvester and check for the combinations. So yeah, we do need this power stream here. Uh, it's £25,000. I am going to purchase it because I'm probably going to need it again at some point. Um, and whilst I get this guy to the field which is just over here I will start moving this guy and actually go pick up my header there we go we've got our header ready go 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 I can start filling up on this pass going down here on, speed up boy catch him up that's how you do it there we go let's fill this trailer right to the top okay keep it coming keep it coming I'm going to the end of <laughs> sorry guys uh, and we will just fill her up as much as we can. This 
field is much larger than I was expecting so it is going to take quite a while to complete but hey well we're going to make the money somewhere and somehow haven't we so and this is the way we're going to do it okay so wheat is probably at its all time low with it being harvest month August yeah all time low so essentially when we have fulfilled the contract we need to s stop as soon as possible so we don't sell any for pennies essentially Yo, let's go and pick up some more. Right, we should have enough for a couple more full loads from the harvester. I'll just get myself out of the way. There we go guys, this is our first fall trailer and let's go and see just how much we fulfill the contract by with just this one full trailer. just need to check where we need to go for it though. <laughs> it's quite far away. Um, it's not something I was sort of planned for. Let's tag it so then we know exactly where we're going. Right, here we are. Let's see how much of the contract we fulfill with a full trailer. 55%. So, another trailer full. In fact, less than a full trailer will fulfill this contract. Which I think will leave around half a trailer left for us to feed our chickens. So this wasn't actually that bad of an idea to do this contract. I'm going to head back over to the farm and continue with the contract and hopefully get it finished. thing what I would like with this game is when you're doing these contracts especially straw oat and barley is if you can still enable the straw swath and produce your own hay bales from uh, land if they ain't gonna 
use the straw, then why can't we use it? Um, that is one thing I'd really like to have in this game. Because then it makes these contracts well more worth doing over just, you know, for a little bit extra grain at the end. We could actually, you know, grab our bailing stuff and then, you know, bail the whole thing up and possibly make a bit extra money from the contract. But it's not like that, unfortunately. Because, like, literally, it's just chucking all this hay and spreading it out. And I don't think it even fertilizes or creates fertilizing or mulching or anything like that. It is just literally spreading out the hay. But hey, what can you do, eh? Okay, that's most of it done. We're just going to do one more final pass along this edge here. And then we should have, well, number one, a full tank and completed this contract completely. So, yeah, let's go and get our trailer, fill it up, and, and then I am going to start making my way to the selling point. Now I know I estimated around 50% of the tank left, but I think it's going to be more... Oh no, it's raining. Not what we want to see. Especially on our final pass along here, because we're going to get 50% of the grain, which isn't great. Why is it raining in August? supposed to be summer. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have much left whatsoever, in all honesty. Probably only going to be a couple of hundred mils. A couple of hundred litres, should I say. Right, okay. Well, that'll do donk it. That'll do anything, like, <laughs> whatever we get from this. We'll just have to do, won't it? Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this guy to go to the farm. But if you guys enjoyed this episode, be sure to drop us a like on the video. Um, that helps us out a ton. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell icon. But on that note, guys, I am going to call it an end to today's espionage of harvesting. Now, we haven't gotten much done but what we have done is set ourselves up for a much deeper future uh, with plenty of money to be made especially from our solar panels and from our chicken farm so in terms of how much wheat we are going to be left over you'll just have to wait until next episode until then guys happy farming